Welcome to the Celebs Trivia Channel. Here you will find some interesting and epic facts about celebrities. Steve Bannon was indicted last year over his failure to cooperate with the Congressional Committee probing the events leading up to the Capitol riot. The former White House chief strategist is said to have been an unofficial advisor to former President Donald Trump at the time of the insurrection on January 6, 2021. He faces up to two years in jail and up to $200,000 in fines. Speaking to reporters outside the courtroom, Mr. Bannon vowed to have the case reversed on what his lawyer called a bulletproof appeal. We may have lost the battle here today, but we're not going to lose this war, he said. His sentencing hearing has been set for October 21st. By, by the way, by the way, by the way, the only, hang, hang on. I want to thank the jury for the, what the effort they did, the judge, particularly the court administration here, everybody. I only have one disappointment, and that is the gutless members of that show trial committee, the J6 committee, didn't have the guts to come down here and testify in open that court. Thank you very much. Sir, Mr. Bannon, does this embolden the committee? Attorneys claimed the trial against Mr. Bannon was an act of political retribution. Mr. Bannon was a key player in former President Donald Trump's 2016 election win, serving first as his campaign chief and later taking on the role of chief strategist at the White House. He left that position amid political fallout from a violent far-right rally in Charlottesville, Virginia, in August 2017. But the podcaster is still considered a top ally of Mr. Trump. The House of Representatives Select Committee investigating the Capitol riots first issued a legal summons to Mr. Bannon in September 2021. The panel has long believed he was involved in efforts by Trump supporters to storm Congress and challenge the outcome of the 2020 presidential election. The day before the attack, he declared on his podcast that all hell is going to break loose tomorrow. Outside the Capitol, the outer ring of security had been breached. The crowds had taken Donald Trump at his word, and they were taking the fight to the heart of American democracy. They were literally banging on the doors of Congress. And then some Trump supporters managed to get inside. They were armed and wandering the Capitol building. There were tense and violent scenes with police who will have never dealt with anything like this. But Mr. Bannon proclaimed his innocence and defied the subpoenas, saying he would turn it into a misdemeanor from hell for the Biden administration. He also maintained his conversations with the former president were covered by executive privilege, a legal principle that holds communications between presidents and their advisors to be protected from disclosure in order to allow for candid advice. A judge, however, ruled he could not claim privilege in, which, in this uh, case. Misdemeanor or felony in which a person is convicted without Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos on the latest celebs trivia.